Hello and welcome to Engineer Hash Civil Engineer. After a very long time, hello guys. In this video, I am going to discuss about canal irrigation and classification of canals. First of all, let's divide these two terms canal and irrigation. What is a canal? Canal is nothing but a human made channel. A man made channel is called as a canal. And what is irrigation? Irrigation is nothing but supply of water to the crops or agricultural lands is called as irrigation. So combining canal irrigation. Supplying of water using canals is called as a canal irrigation. Canal irrigation is a very important part of irrigation. It is a major source of irrigation in agricultural countries. These two are examples of how canals look like. This is a lined canal. This is an unlined canal. I'm going to explain what is a lined canal and an unlined canal. And here this is the layout how the canal is subdivided into its branches. And next we have classification of canals. Canals can be classified depending upon six factors. First one is classification based on nature of source of supply classification based on financial output classification based on function classification based on boundary and surface classification based on discharge and relative importance of the canals and next last we have classification based on canal alignment these are six types of classifications of canals we are going to discuss each and every one individually. Classification based on nature of source of supply. We have permanent canal and inundation canal. In permanent canal, the source of water supply in the canal is permanent. Means it is available 365 days in a year. Such canals are called as permanent canals. They are also called as perennial canals. These canals will have masonry works and all other permanent works. And for inundation canal, the water is only available when the river has floods or the storage level in the reservoir is full. Only then we will have water in inundation canals. These are called also called as temporary canals. And next we have classification based on financial output. We have productive canals and protective canals. What is a productive canal? Productive canal in which after the complete completion of the canal, the canal generates a revenue to the nation. It generates a yield. Such canals is called as productive canal. What is a protective canal? Protective canal is a type of canal which helps or which mitigates, uh, which helps in uh, to supply water to the drought prone areas or to the famine areas. Such canals are called as protective canals. So let's revise productive canal it generates income whereas protective canal is just to avoid the drought or famine such canals are called as protective canals canals are also classified based upon their function we have five such canals irrigation canal carrier canal feeder canal navigation canal and power canal so the name itself tells irrigation canal is nothing but the canals which are used for the function of irrigation carrier canal is it helps the it helps for irrigation and it also carries water for another canal whereas in feeder canal the only purpose is it helps in feeding another canals two or more canals it feeds water to two or more canals whereas we have navigation canal where you can navigate using small small boats and ships such canals are called as 
navigation canals we have suez canal or panama canal are examples of this navigation canal and we have power canal power canal is nothing but it the water it carries water which helps in generation of power such canals are called as power canal this is classification based on function and next we have classification based on the boundary surface look at this this is a lined canal or a rigid boundary canal here this is an unlined canal here you don't have rigid boundary this rigid boundary lesses the the infiltration losses of the water and this non rigid boundary canal is again classified into two types alluvial canals and non alluvial canals in alluvial canals you have silt as the boundary whereas in non alluvial canals you have clay or soil uh, clay sand or rock strata such canals are called as non alluvial canals again i am going to revise this uh, we have rigid canals or uh, lined canals these are called as unlined canals or unrigid canals and this unrigid canals or unlined canals is divided into two types alluvial canals and non alluvial canals alluvial canals have silt as its strata where non alluvial canals have clay or st rock strata as their bed and next we have classification based on the discharge and relative importance see a single canal cannot irrigate the entire country so we need to have sub branches depending upon its discharge so the canals are classified based on discharge we have here main canal branch canal major distributary minor distributary and we have water course so what is a main canal the canal which carries water directly from the reservoir or the river such canal is called as main canal here this dark blue line is called as a main canal and when this dark blue line gets divided into two or three branches such canals are called as branch canals and this branch canal can carry up to 5 cubic and there are few distributaries from the main canal or the branch canal such distributaries are again classified into major distributary and minor distributary here if you look at this this is a major distributary and this is a minor distributary the difference between two is the major distributary carries from one fourth of a cubic to five cubics of water whereas a minor distributary carries 0 to 0 0.25 cubics of water and these major and minor distributaries are the actual canals which carry water to the irrigation fields and next we have water course water course is nothing but it is these are the simple canals which carry water directly to the field itself directly into the field such canals are called as water course canals this is the brief layout how the canal irrigation looks like this is the layout and I request all of you if you understand the different classifications of canals and what is canal irrigation please hit like button please share this video with your friends please subscribe my channel if you are a new visitor and next we have classification based on canal alignment here this is the natural river course this is the natural river course and when the canal and these are the contours 
of the 